So right, now I can start to develop. So uh, I have alphabet the side of this upper surface, which is this one, isn't it? Which is this one. Then the below part surface of it is the one that is with numbers. You understand? So now I want to start with my development. So I will start by placing my drawing compass at this point further extended to point M of my point M <clears throat> so without disturbing my drawing compass so I can come down here and be like I want to start to have my development right here right here so I don't know if I can see it if so I want to have my development starting from here coming this side you understand so now I can come and place it here and mark it there so I'll come to say this is A and this one is X so you can have it solid there you go draw it solid so which one is this one X A is this one X A you understand so now I come to my top view just zoom it a little bit I want distance from X to X actual X to X so you can call it like that so this is it now this one I'll have to convert it to my true length from here to there which is the XX isn't it so I come to my true length and place it at R and and mark it like that so this is XX this one has to pro project it to the median point there you go so now I can take my drawing compass and place it here to get the true length now the height it has been considered so without it disturbing it now I can come to my development portion uh, development portion X and just give it a map up there so now from here to right there is your x you understand so now if i place my drawing so this is x a x x thereby our top view which is which one which is this one a x x you understand so now if i place my drawing compass at point a to x and convert it, it to what to my true length and convert it to my true length after converting it I take it to my development it has to give me the very same the, the, the very same length from here till here so let me prove that how go back to my top view place it at this point X further extended to point A this is it now without disturbing it I come and place it at my R and mark there so this one is going to be A X isn't it true length A X so there you go then from there I place my drawing compass here to at the point mid and point that one so now that disturbing my drawing compass I come to my development I place it at A and it corresponds it corresponds it, it, it corresponds so it shows which we are at a right track so I can have it this one then dark this one dark right so 
AA, I mean XX is switch one there by our two view is this one from there till there. You understand? A AX is this one there by our two view. AX, you understand? So, so with that, so AX, which is which one now? It's, it's look like it's the hypotenuse, this one from there till there. You understand? So now let's continue then. Let's continue so what I'm going to do now take my drawing compass place it at point get the equal space now which is I can simply place it at 3 further extended to point 2 which is this one right now I come to my development portion. Development portion, I strike an arc this side. I'm looking for point uh, 11. I'm looking for 3. I'm looking for point 10 which is this one point 10 which is this one not 11 yet so now to get point 10 because this is 9 isn't it this is a this is 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 you understand so I'm looking for point what now a 10 a 9 we a 9 we already have it so which means yeah i can say this is x the x is still in the same point with what with nine isn't it in the same point with nine so now i'm looking for point what point 10 now place my drawing compass to point a further extend it to the point that i'm looking for which is point 10 this one there by my two you place it at a further extend it to what to point 10 which is this one you understand so now this one I'll have to convert it we convert it to my true length place it at R and mark there so this is going to be a 10 construct it and then point there you go then after that one place it here till it median point so now without disturbing your drone compass can come back now to my development and place it where at point a now point a which is a and mark thing so now I draw it dark so this is 10 understand so after getting point 10 take your drawing compass place it at point 10 further extended to point 9 this is it and get strike an arc or you draw a full cycle as long as it's going to be faint you understand as long as it's faint like this one of mine it's okay or you can strike an arc still on the same thing so now I'm looking for point what point 11 this one this one 11 to a 11 to a Eleven to a this is the point I'm looking for so 11 a to 11 there you go this is it I have to convert it to my true length go to your true length you place it at R and mark there so this is what this is a 11 isn't it and there you go then from there place it at 11 further extended to your median point this is it right 
then after that one you come to your development without disturbing it you come to your development now you place it at A and you bisect that uh, cycle of yours and from there there you go this is going to be your point 11 you understand so now we are looking for point what point zero point zero which is a zero which is a zero remember that this one is the upper surface who's telling you that is your is your front view so remember this one is your front view so this one is the bottom surface who's telling you that you can see that clearly there by your what your top uh, front view is when this one okay now we are looking for a zero a zero a zero or a 12 still one same thing so before that go back to your development and do what and place your drawing compass at point 11 further extend it to point 10 like this then you strike an arc or a, a cycle like this faint then from there you go back to your top view place a drawing compass at point A to the point that you are looking for which is point zero isn't it then after that one convert it to your true length you can come and place it at R and mark so this is my A zero and construct it to your median point there you go then after that A zero eh? there you go to median point just that one and from there come to my development now mark mark so this becomes zero a zero so there you go then from there place the drawing compass at zero Further extend to point 11, strike an arc, faint, or draw a full cycle that's going to be like this. You understand? So now we are looking for point what? Point 1. Go back to your top view, which is this one. Top view, we have A, 0. A, 0. So now we must say 0, B. Mm -hmm. So we must say, isn't it? You, we we like eleven a a zero zero b. Mm -hmm. So I can indicate so zero b. So if we are now we are looking for point b. So take your drawing compass, place it at point a. There by your top view further ascend to point B that you are looking for so this is it so this is the alphabet to an alphabet so we are not going to convert it to our true length erase this one you don't need it anymore so this is it I come and place it at A and strike an arc this side strike an arc this side so along this arc i must get what a point b along this arc i must get point b you understand so now to get point b we are going to use z zero and a to get point b along this arc you understand so now go back to your top view place your drawing compass at point what at point zero to the point that you're looking for which is point b isn't it this is it 
now without disturbing your drawing compass convert it to your true length which is r and so there it is so there it is after that one construct it mid and point then from there this is it now come and place it at point zero and you bisect this arc that you just got there you go you understand so now I can have it dark from here till there from here till there not yet for now so but this one is point what now is point B eh? go back to your top view we've gotten point B already go back to your top view you understand so there is our top view that we have now then from there we have to get a distance of B2 B1 oh this is 0 1 2 3 so B1 so there you go B1 B1 place it at B further extend it to 1 which is this one then convert it to a true length Convert it to true length. This is P1. So P1 is in the same line with what? With A0. P1 in the same line with A0. So there you go. To true length. Give you the true length. This is it. Now without disturbing it, you come to a development. Where is your B? Then you place it here, point B, then you you strike an arc there. That's going to be my point one. Right? Then I can have this one. Right. That's B one. That's B one, isn't it? So from there, we are going to do what now? Let me see, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, so now we are going to uh, place the drawing compass at point, uh, at point, uh, point what, point B, further extending to point A. this one and strike an arc that's going to be like this there you go so we are going to look forward now for one C with A B we have to get C along this arc along this arc you understand so go and construct it clearly there by your what your top view so one to see there you go so one to see this is it i have to convert it to my true length there you go this is C1 isn't it and from there there you go now get it C1 to median point this is it now come back to your development 
and place it at one and get a C. So there is my point C. Construct it. There you go. Now I have to get C, C2. So I can place my drone compass at point one. Further extend to point zero. So there you go, faint. There you go, faint. So I have to get C, and this look like my development is going to <coughs> affect my top view. Okay, but let's go. Now I'm looking for point C two. C two. C two. Let me construct it. There you go. C two. Compass to C to the point that I'm looking for, which is point two. Without it disturbing it, uh, I, I convert it to my true length. So there is my C. C2 is that one. Then I can construct it. There it goes. Now this is C2. Further extend it towards to Indian point, which is this one. Then from there, come to my development. Place it at C. Then I mark. Now I can construct it. There you go. This is point two. So I have to get point D now. How? Place my drawing compass at C. Further extend to point B. There you go. Faint. I go faint to draw this cycle faint. <coughs> so go back to your top view. Top view and then we are looking for C uh, two two D which is 2D which is this one which is this one right so 2 place it at 2 to the point that I'm looking for which is point D and then convert it to your true length there it is then from there This one, isn't it? This is a uh, D two. Construct it. There you go. And from there, D two to my median point. Then after disturbing, before you even disturb your train compass, then go to a development. Then you place it at two, then you get point D. That's going to be point D. So now I can go like this. There you go. So now to get point three, I can place my drawing compass at two. Where is it? Two further extended to point one. This is it. There you go. There you go. So I'm looking for point three along this axle. So I am going to place my drawing compass there by my top view at point D to point three that I'm looking for which is the center and the center 
happen. This is it. But then, I have to convert it to my true length. Place it at R. There it is. So this is D. Uh, D not B. D3. Then I take it to my true length. M. Median point D3. Now I come and place it here. Further extend it to my median point. Which is this one. So come start disturbing your drawing compass after you've gotten the true length without disturbing come to your art to your development so I can place it at D and mark that's point that's point 3 that's my point 3 right then from there I have to get point E C D E Place your drawing compass at point D. Step by your development further extended to point C. Strike an arc or draw a full cycle as long as it's going to be faint so that I get 3 A uh, to E along this uh, 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 whether if you strike an arc along that arc whether if you throw the complete uh, diameter as long as it's faint within this circumference you understand so now we are looking for a uh, point point three e go back to your top view point three e so which means from here to right there from here Three to point E. You understand? So without disturbing it, you come to your true true length. This is this is point E three. Then construct it to your median point. There you go. Now place it here to then point to get the true length without disturbing your drawing compass. Now come to your development. Now you, you you come back to what to your development. To your development you place it at point three and bisect that arc. So this is going to be point E. Now I can construct it. There you go. Um, so now I'm looking for point four. So which means I have to place my drawing compass at three, further extend to point two. So there you go, a striking arc, or I draw a full cycle as long as it's faint. You you, you understand? So. Now I'm looking for point E4. Go back to your top view. Point E4, E4. So I must have an imaginary line that's going to be of this nature. You understand? So now I can place my drone compass at point E to 4. And convert that e to 4 is the same as xx so e 4 still there yeah same point so there you go just this one remember to your m isn't it so now without disturbing your drawing compass come to your development now I place it at point E and get a point four there. Get a point four right there. So there you go. Anyway. So now I have to get point F. This side point F. 
So please sit.